thank you for spending this time with me. I'd like to take a few minutes now to show you through our showroom. We've spent a lot of time and effort to make our showroom as varied as possible. There are many challenges in homes with spacing, and we've tried to duplicate some of those challenges here. So come with me and let's take a look. This is a Fabby Wood display in their ivory color with the Wellington door. It's showcasing a farmhouse sink, fluted columns, and a solid wood counter from Grow House Lumber. We've made it up to look like a potting shed. This is a bar by Fabby Wood. We have glass cabinets with glass shelves, a stepped counter to display your favorite alcohol and liqueurs. We have big pot and pan drawers, which you don't typically need in a bar, but that's what we show here. A wine fridge, Chicago bar rail to make comfortable leaning. And we show different types of cabinet sides and backs, whether it's beadboard or applied molding to the side of the cabinet to dress it up. This is your man cave. This is a Yorktown display, and it's in a medium maple color with beautiful crown molding, five different pieces that stack, and we've popped out the cabinet over the microwave so you can appreciate that detail. We have a cooktop here. This laminate countertop is unique in that it has an undermount sink. Yes, you can undermount a sink with laminate counters. And we have a really cool pull-out pantry here, so it makes it really easy to access the things in the back. This Yorktown pantry is made of quarter sawn oak, and unlike a really deep pantry, shallow pantries like this are fantastic. It's very easy to get to things inside. We have ours filled with display items, but yours would be filled with boxes of cereal, chips, whatever, and it's all right at your fingertip. This display is by Plain and Fancy, and it shows off what they do best, anything you want. We created this display with this crown molding that they've never made before. We said we want these doors to have an X in the top and we want this bar to be so far from the top. We wanted opaque glass. This is solid walnut frame with a bird's eye maple veneer panel in the middle. Natural in both cases. This molding detail, we drew it, they made it. Now if we come down here to the base cabinets, you can see it has the Kessa Boomer Lazy Susan that closes all by itself. We have Kessa Boomer pull-out pantry. And then if we walk over to here, you can see we have integrated side panels. We even have custom-made arch supports or brackets for the counter. This wonderful display showcases a lot of great features. Right here we have a Stanichi hood that was shipped to Plain and Fancy for them to finish in their shop. It has pull-out corbel cabinets here so we have access to spices and oils right by the cooking surface. These beautiful gothic style doors with a two-tone finish, a dark interior, and a light exterior. This is a two-tone kitchen, as you see. We have the hood and cherry, and some of the base cabinets over here are in white. We purposely made this counter opposite this counter exactly 42 inches, which is the minimum recommended distance between opposing surfaces. You have counter seating here, and lots of bells and whistles inside to explore. This island top is by Grow House Lumber. If you've seen a wood top on the cover of your favorite magazine, it's probably theirs. This top is an end grain where you see the different pieces of wood joined together. This is solid natural walnut, natural wenge, and natural maple, all pieced together to create a fun, beautiful, eye-catching piece. This kitchen is by Ultracraft. The white cabinets are offset by a very pale backsplash and the white galaxy granite. The sink is a D bowl, nice and deep and big. And this is a microwave drawer. Pulls out and you have easy access to your contents in there. The corner is one of my favorites. Look at that. 
an easy reach cabinet where everything is right at your fingertips. The top cabinets here offset the solid cabinets everywhere else and give you a place to showcase pretty things. Today's busy families love to have a mudroom and how about this one? We have a comfortable seat here to put on your boots with storage below. A chalkboard insert into these doors allows you to keep easy messages and grocery lists. There's lift up storage above with baskets, hooks for coats, and over here a planning desk for recipes, bill paying, whatever your needs are. Woodmode is a fantastic line of cabinetry and this piece shows it off to its best. Inset cabinets, end glass, beautiful backsplash here with beveled glass mirrors, and look, you can even get walnut drawers which offset the white cabinets beautifully. Thank you for taking the time to walk through our showroom with me. I hope you can visit in person. Please make an appointment when you come and you can get our hours on our website. Our website also has many forms of information for you to check out, budget lists, information about the different counter types and their pluses and minuses, etc. We do work in the greater Philadelphia area, even down to the southern parts of Jersey Shore, all the way up to Connecticut and out to Lancaster. So we'd be happy to help you wherever your project is.